Drop wall deployed. Boom block. Drop wall deployed. Boom block. Drop wall deployed. Boom block. Hey guys, Blazin here. Welcome to my analysis on the drop wall. The drop wall is a usable piece of Forerunner equipment. It can be deployed in combat to provide the player with temporary shelter from enemy gunfire and is capable of blocking explosives as well. When deployed, the drop wall has 15 sections of energy shields, but they can only withstand a certain amount of damage from the outside before a section fails. Multiple sections can fail without the entire drop wall shutting down. So those are various common weapons and explosives I tested against the drop wall. Now I would have shown the cinder shot, but currently the weapon pad in this little area I made is glitched. Uh, so thanks 343. Additionally, the user is still able to shoot and throw grenades through the drop wall. Players can also walk through the drop wall as well as vehicles. Now as far as the best way to counter the drop wall, it is very simple. Literally just deal damage to the device. Take down the device itself and the whole shield goes away instantly. Moving on to stats on the drop wall, you can hold up to 3 charges and the time it takes for the device to activate is 0.5 seconds. Once deployed, the drop wall lasts for 12 seconds before it expires, and the recharge time to throw another drop wall is around 5 seconds. So that's pretty much it on the drop wall, but not quite. By the time I was done getting footage, I got curious. So here's the drop wall versus other pieces of equipment. Alright, and that's the drop wall. Overall, I don't have a lot to say about it. I'd probably alter certain things about it, but in my opinion, I think the drop wall is riding that fine line where it's useful enough to the point that it does help you, but it's also not overpowered either. This kind of equipment typically wouldn't be allowed in competitive play, so it's pretty good that 343 made this weak enough to where it doesn't interrupt competitive play too much. There are some things that the Halo 3 deployable cover does better, but maybe I can talk about that another time. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed, hit that subscribe button if you enjoy the content on this channel, and let me know your thoughts on the drop wall in the comments below. And until next time, peace.